We have some developing news tonight. Texas State University police stepped in to keep order during a protest on campus after things started to escalate. CBS Austin Jamal Kennedy has been working to learn the details about what happened and is live in San Marcos for us tonight. Jamal, you spoke with two students who witnessed what happened. What did they see? Yeah, what I'm standing on the other side of the Johnson Student Center here at Texas State, which is where this protest, this demonstration, whatever you want to call it, took place this afternoon. And the two students who walked by say they heard inappropriate things being said, and they say they saw inappropriate things on display. I don't think there's any room for that on this campus. On the campus of Texas State University, San Marcos Wednesday afternoon, demonstrators gathered outside the Johnson Student Center holding signs with what some people considered to be offensive language. Cade Crockett was walking to class when he saw what was happening. I think it's very shameful that people assume that it's okay to uh, promote this behavior, to promote this bigotry. A statement from a Texas State spokesperson says the university supports the First Amendment and is required by state law to uphold free speech in public areas on campus, even if it upsets students. I mean, obviously there's like free speech, but like that's just gonna start a fight. Like no matter what side you're on, that's just something crazy to say. And I think they knew that. They just wanted a uh, reaction. Raymond Walsh was walking with Crockett and says while he didn't want to get involved in the protest, he saw a crowd of students around the demonstrators. There's a bunch of people crowding around. I don't know if anyone's going to fight or something crazy. It's, people, it's just after Election Day. A Texas state spokesperson says the demonstrators were not students, nor did they have any affiliations with the school. But I also know, believe it was done from um, a sense of engagement almost, entitlement. Now, the university says the protesters were not arrested and they left uh, campus shortly after that on their own. We do know a little bit about them. They call themselves the official street preachers. And according to their website, uh, one of their goals is to provide broadcasting and reporting that covers global and local news from the Christian perspective. And in their own words, one of their goals is to, quote, awaken others, close quote. Now, again, uh, no one was arrested and they left the university of their own, is what we were told by the university spokesperson. For now, reporting live from Texas State University in San Marcos. Jamal Kennedy, CBS Austin News.